Hi and welcome back to another video. Today we are taking a look at Excel and looking at some of the reasons why your formulas might not be working. Um, this is going to be a pretty quick tutorial so if you do find it useful please hit the like button and with that said let's jump on over to Excel. Okay so here we are just inside Excel and I've just got a couple of examples. Um, here we have some sales and a formula and then we've got some sales here and another some formula. Now these two different examples are doing two different things. This first one, um, the formula is actually being written out even though we know that it has an equal sign um, and the formula is correct. Um, and we can go into this and we can see you know, what's going on there is correct. Um, but yet still it only shows us as uh, if it were written as text. And the reason for this is if we click into this particular cell and go over to the home tab on the ribbon we can see that actually this cell has been formatted as text. Um, so to fix this issue all we really need to do is highlight the entire sheet um, and make sure that it has been formatted either as a number or as general or uh, anything other than text basically. So if I select um, number um, and now I come back down into this particular formula here what we can do into it um, and just press return and we are now getting uh, the formula coming through correctly. Okay, so that's the first type of error that you might come across um, where the formatting of the cell is actually formatted as text. The second kind of error is this one here where we can see this is doing the same thing. It's summarizing this entire range of values, except it's coming out as zero where we know that this is actually contains 100, 200, 300, 400, 5, 6 and 700, right? Um, and we know that is greater than zero. So the reason that this is happening is because these are not numbers. Um, so we need to actually convert these into numbers rather than um, being treated as text as they are. Now, this is being treated as text independently of the formatting of the home tab ribbon here. So where we know we've just selected the entire sheet to be numbers, um, these actually have a parent, uh, sorry, a little apostrophe at the beginning of each number, which is forcing this to basically be text rather than um, Excel recognizing it as a number. Now we have this little warning sign on the uh, left hand side, whereas we take a drop down here, we can see that we can convert this to a number. Um, so if I convert that one to a number, what I can then do is actually select the entire thing here and convert to number. And now the entire range here is being selected um, and I can just press return and now we go, we have the correct value. Now if I just step back a couple of times, um, there's a couple of ways that you can do this. So obviously we can highlight a entire range of cells um, and then choose to convert from number here. Or we can choose the entire range of cells here, go to, um, I believe it's the insert tab, um, also the formulas, data data tab, sorry. We go to the data tab um, and then we go to text to columns and then we delimit uh, this. Um, it doesn't really matter what we use there, we just click finish and that will also convert it into a number. Um, or one of my personal favourites where if I have a spare column to the right hand side I can just go equals this particular um, value here multiplied by one and that will also convert it into a number. Okay. So what I'm going to quickly do here is just uh, convert these to number and then have uh, my formula updated accordingly. Now, the other thing that we may notice you may get um, is this scenario here where these are all numbers, um, our formatting is fine, but our formula still is not working. Um, and this can happen if um, for any reason that we have actually disabled automatic updates of the formulas. So to fix this we go to the home tab, uh, so we go to the ribbon and then we go across to the formulas tab and then over on the far right hand side we have calculation options. From the drop down menu here we select automatic and now our formula is working. Um, the other thing that might have been selected and that's causing you errors um, would be the show formulas section. Now if this button has been activated you'll have all of these formulas being shown as if they were written out in text. Um, however, they are not just text um, formatted. Um, they are basically um, the formula being shown to you in text form so that you can read those formulas back. Um, and to fix this, all you'd have to do is deselect the show formulas button here 
and your spreadsheet should be up and running without any issues. Um, and that is it guys. It's um, pretty simple to just kind of go through those few different um, troubleshooting steps um, uh, to fix any of your formula issues that you are having with any kind of um, formatting issues or um, not automatically updating issues or trying to calculate things based on um, so some values based on text etc. So if you found this useful please click the like button and I'll catch you guys in the next video.